Hey guys, Ryan McCrum here at Zimbrick Audi of Madison. Today, we're gonna look at how to properly get your seat into the correct position because there is a correct position. Let's take a look. Okay, so I know most of you, if you're in an A4 or really just any Audi, you're gonna want your seat back, you're gonna wanna look cool, have your, your, your hand reaching up high, like you look like Vin Diesel. And however this is cool, it's not correct. How you want to have your seat positioned to, have you, to, to give you the most support is utilize this stomp pad down on your, under your left foot. The way you'd want this to, to be, that's really gonna dictate how everything else unfolds here. You want your foot flat, on top of that with your heel all the way to the bottom. Now, once you get that positioned, if you at all feel like you're reaching for it, you need to put your seat forward. You don't want your knee to be up here though. You want it to just set nicely right on, on the bottom of your seat so your hamstring has that support without feeling like you're pushing back on yourself or reaching for it. So once you get the seat forward enough to be right there now, you should be able to put your arms straight out with your back against the seat and have your wrists on top of the steering wheel. Clearly, I'm too far back, so I'm gonna bring my seat up. There we go, now I feel engaged. Now I can put my wrists on the top of that steering wheel and really have control over the car. However, now that I have that positioned the right way, I look down here and it feels like I'm, I'm you know, I'm, my legs is extended how I'd like it to, but I'm just not getting quite the support. Well, these seats have tilting features. It can't just go back and forward and up and down, but you can actually tilt the front up or tilt the back up. So I'm gonna tilt the front up a little bit just to tuck it under my hamstring ever so slightly. And if you're a long-legged person, no worries. We have this about an inch and a half of hamstring extension to make you really feel like you can relax that leg and have it stomp down. Now, back against the seat, wrist on top of the steering wheel. As long as I have my virtual cockpit clear in sight, we are good to go. Now, you're in a cockpit wrapped around you. We are locked and loaded and ready to hit the road with full control over our vehicle. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're coming out with videos every week the link is in the description. If you have any questions, feel free to stop by. I'll see you in the next video.